Hey guys, it's me. Hey. Uh, so basically, I got a request on YouTube to sort of show you guys how to use Sparkle Cam on uh, programs such as OBS and XSplit. Uh, so basically, it's really easy, and we'll, we'll go to the desktop. It's gonna look really weird. Just, just hang in there. What you do is you basically right-click, you add a video capture device. We're gonna call it Sparky for no apparent reason. And here in your device list, you can choose from the integrated webcam to any other external webcams that you may have installed via USB, uh, which is the usual way. But then, of course, for me, I've got my DSLR hooked up, so I'm using SparkleCam, the virtual webcam, and there I am. Now, for OBS, remember how to edit a scene, which is basically you press the edit scene, and you can, by dragging it around the corner, you can't see my mouse except like that, so my mouse right here. You can drag it like that. You can also drag it like that to sort of change the size, even though there's really no difference. Hold Alt to crop, as always, um, and crop it nicely, will you? Try and leave no black borders, and obviously just put your mouse on the face of the thing, of, of the panel, and just move it around like that. And we'll just bring it down so that there's two of me right here. You can see. Something that will probably give me nightmares, so I'm going to delete it, delete it, and we're back to normal. Now, ugh. now I actually have Skype open right now, so if I minimize that and I press that, that should do it. All right. So anyway, it's Miku. Don't worry. <laughs> we have the general settings right here for Skype. Is this uh, Sparkle Cam actually does work for Skype, so right now here's my integrated webcam, which is terrible, to say the least. Here's the Sparkle Cam virtual web, my DSLR. Can be my webcam because that's how great Sparkle Cam is. At one point, I, re I heard that Skype was apparently killing off the XSplit broadcaster uh, ability, like the XSplit broadcaster third-party API, but apparently not, um, at least not right now. It, it was supposed to be killed off during an update a while ago, but I guess that's not a thing anymore. So we can, do, we can still do that. Uh, yeah. For, for XSplit, and also, yeah, for XSplit, basically, if you want to use SparkleCam on XSplit, it's just basically you go to the bottom left hand of the, of the screen, it's add uh, video recording device, no, add camera, uh, and then Sparkle Cam virtual web camera. If for some reason you can't find it in your list of devices, I have no idea how to fix that. You could try reinstalling Sparkle Cam, you could also try reinstalling your recording device, uh, your recording software, such as if it's OBS, just try reinstalling OBS, or if it's XSplit, etc. If it's Skype, then try reinstalling Skype. But otherwise, that's really about it. Yeah, so until next time, this has been another how-to video ever since my last how-to video, which was probably up to and no more than half a year ago. I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching.